Well, hello there. Mm -hmm. uh, I thought I would do a vlog today because I didn't really know what else to do and it's been a while since I've done a vlog, so that is what I am doing. I am currently getting ready. I am going out for a meal, well, like lunch. I'm so fancy. Um, it's Kate's birthday and Kate is my friend slash my boss, so... I have a feeling like you would have seen it in the vlog. She's also my hairdresser, so. She's definitely been in videos from like when I've been getting my hair done and stuff. So, I'm just getting ready to go there. I probably won't like vlog the meal because um, there's a lot of people going and although quite a lot of them know that I do YouTube it would still be a little bit awkward just for me to like you know get my camera out so yeah I won't do that but after the meal luckily it's early um this skirt that I bought from Primark which was in that haul it's too big too big I got a size eight so I'm going to have to go to size 6. What the hell? I really hope like they've still got it because it was a week ago that I bought it. But how on earth am I wearing a size 6? Now, update on my whole weight loss thing. I can tell I've like... The thing is, because I've been going to the gym now, some like you do fluctuate because muscle weighs more than that, right? Um, so on the scale I'm like four pounds heavier but on my body it's ridiculous so this dress that I'm wearing today um, I've undone this whilst I get ready because I can't bend my elbows but this dress I wore this on Mother's Day and it was tight and it feels so big I'm just like where have I gone <laughs> so um I'm definitely getting smaller. I wake up every morning and I feel more and more lean. Um, so, I mean, I'm not complaining, this is what I want, but because on the scale I'm heavier, I was like, I feel so fat. But then looking at myself and seeing how my clothes are fitting me, I'm like, no. So, it's definitely true. Once you start the gym, you have to throw away the sad step. The sad step being the weighing scale because you. You just can't weigh yourself when you're at the gym unless you're like trying to lean down. Like, no. Unless you're in a competition and do you know what I mean? You have to get really low so all your muscles show. But I don't want that. I just want to look like toned. So it doesn't really matter what my weight is as long as I eat right and go to the gym. And by eat right, I mean have a treat every day. And the eyeshadow. So yes, this is just pretty much me getting ready. Not really got much more that I want to ramble about. So I'll show you my face when I'm done. So this is how I did my makeup today. Just like a coppery brown smoky eye with Kylie. Dolce K on my lips, I did use a darker liner to make it a little bit darker, but yeah, that is pretty much my makeup. Uh, nice and simple, and I, do, I literally just brushed my hair because I've not got time to style it. I'm just burning a CD for the car, and then I'm going out. My, let's zoom it out a little bit, kind of show you the outfit. So this is my denim dress from Boohoo, and I'm just wearing it with tights because it's like I don't know how warm it is outside, it is sunny, but I don't know. And then I have on my creepers because I'm a bit edgy like that. Oh, and I'm gonna put on my watch. I always forget to put jewelry on. My Pandora. I almost forgot perfume. CD's ready. <laughs> I'm gonna wear flash.
town with me like I said because I'm such a chicken <laughs> and I don't want to turn the skirt by myself um, my meal was very very nice too full, I'm nicely full, I've learned what I can, like, what agrees with me and what doesn't, um, ever since, like, losing weight, um, well, it's before losing weight, I don't know if I discussed it, that certain foods just not agree with me, like, creams and stuff like that, so I pick wisely when ordering food now, so that I'm not left feeling really uncomfortable and stuff, so I feel really nice and full. Uh, I'm not sure if Chloe wants to get a Costa or not, but like, you know, I've even got room for a Costa, which is nice. Whereas usually I would be really bloated and like lethargic and feel really like after going out for dinner. Whereas now I just feel absolutely fine. Um, but yeah, we're just driving into town. Um, I'll show you Chloe to my bed life. And yeah, Chloe was out last night, so she's not feeling as good as what I'm feeling. <laughs> So, props to be teetotal. <laughs> so yeah, we're literally just on the outskirts of town now. As you know, Chloe's a brave vlogger, so she'll probably just like film whilst we're walking about the shops or whatever. But just need to take the skirt back, um, buy Kate's birthday present. I am, if I do get myself anything, I, it's going to be a cost of like, please do not let me spend any money. Oh, um. uh, because I don't need anything as much as there's things that I would like. Not, it's not a necessity, so, yeah. <laughs> well, time on my life. See you soon. We've just caught our cousin on a secret date with her new boyfriend, so we're now embarrassing her. <laughs> Getting <laughs> the uh, <laughs> She's gonna hate us as we are her big embarrassing cousins. <laughs> oh, so Chloe epically failed in making me not buy anything. Oh god, yeah. I ended up with the Dior foundation. <laughs> I'm rough. Out. So this is what I got conned <laughs> into buying. It is the Dior Skin Forever foundation, and this is the box. I just realised it's got SPF 35. How good is that? Um, what colour am I? I am in medium beige. I'm so pale. <laughs> but Chloe said herself, like inside and like with us being outside, she's like, that is the best match. This is where she did it. The best match that I've seen on you, like in ages. Oh my God, look at the bottle. It's so nice. I feel like a super, like, I don't know. I just feel like Dior is such a, high end brand like I own a Dior foundation like what <laughs> like I've had Armani and not that Armani is not prestige but growing up like Dior was just like do you know what I mean so uh yeah I'm really excited let me know get me to do first impressions on it because obviously all I've had is like the little bit on my face um so obviously this is going to go up when on the day I've bought it because it's Sunday today um and yeah, I'm, I'll, I will film like me putting it on tomorrow for the first day, like first time, like just in case you do want to see it. But yeah, let me know in the comments if you want me to do first impressions on it. Not gonna lie, I'm not really sure if I've seen anyone else on YouTube talk about this. I'm not too sure. I, I'm knowing, like I know me and how I'm gonna go home and like YouTube it tonight to see what other people think of it. But yeah, really good. Um, the lady was so nice, she gave me a free makeup bag. Um, I'm not even sure what it looks like, so let's have a look. But yeah, she looks like, I'll give you one of these. Because you're buying two things. I can show you what I got Kate for her birthday because she won't watch this video before her birthday. Oh, it's cute! Oh, that's been nice on holiday. I know, this really nice pink makeup bag with Dior on it. And then the little, the seat, like the Christine Dior. Christian Dior like CD little thing and then it's just black on the inside it's got like CD 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 on it I don't know if that'll show up on the camera but that is such a little cute present for myself <laughs> and what I got Kate was 
the Dior Lip Glow. So I got it in like 001, the pink one. They do now have, if correct me if I'm wrong, a peach one and possibly like a reddy one or a purple one. I'm not too sure. But this pink one was like the original one. And how cute is this? I love Dior's packaging for like literally everything. And it's literally just a really nice like pink bottom, but it alters to the color of your lips, whatever like natural pigmentation you have. So it could be a different colored pink on anyone. So obviously if you get the coral one, it'll be a different shade of coral or you know, like whatever. So they're just a really nice moisturizing lip balm slash tint lipstick. Yeah, I got this for her because one of the clients that comes into work, she wore it and she was in the, like, in the salon for like three hours and she didn't even have to reapply it. She'd had a cup of tea and everything and Kate was like, oh, I really like it. And I was like, don't buy yourself, I'll buy you for your birthday. But I think she's forgot that I said I was buying it. She's still not bought it, but she's like, what are you getting me for my birthday? So I'm like, she's not remembered. And then I just switched my skirt. Like I said, somehow I am a size six, WTF. I did try out another skirt in Primark, which I randomly found on the sale aisle, and that was a size six, and that fit me as well. So I don't get, I don't, am I that thin? Am I really? Mm. You lost a lot. Okay, well, fun times. So apologies if my makeup looks a mess, but I didn't take any Puritan, AKA ran out of Puritan, and I've had watery eyes all day. So I think I'm gonna get myself, um, Costa because I'm not ready to take Chloe back yet. And then we're gonna show you the horses. Oh yeah, and then Chloe's gonna take me to go see um, the horses that Josh's uncle has. Uncle has. And and I'm nursing Cleo back to health. I don't know who Cleo is. We're gonna show him. Uh, but Josh is Chloe's boyfriend and um yeah, just in case you didn't know. Yeah. Well, I was just and from a he's from a family of very horsey people. Yeah. <laughs> and we are not. <laughs> no. We're like the people that are petrified of horses. Yeah. But we're just gonna go, you know, because I'm gonna miss a vlog. Yeah. And do on this Sunday afternoon. I thought I had lipstick on my teeth. I don't get proud of that I have lipstick on my teeth. No. Damn your such a <laughs> So I've just brought Lashana to the yard, so we'll show you. A few of the horses. She's a little bit nervous because they are so big. Here they are, some of them. I'll show you my favourite is down here. Hello. Hey. I never used to be, honestly. Lie. I wouldn't wouldn't even dream of going near them. They used to petrify me. But we'll go with these because I'll show you. But yes, this is my favourite. This is Lincoln. He is a stallion and he is a big champion. Now, beginning. Bigger. But I will film again when we go to see Cleo. I am really lucky with like where I live in England because we do have like countryside and we have like rivers and lakes and stuff like that like fields and farms <laughs> and then factories oh but this is this is stamp i am a, a city girl so obviously <laughs> seeing the horses up close i was a little bit scared <laughs> I'll show you a little stamp. He's a bit of an abandoned one, this one. Like, nobody really pays him any attention. Stamp! It's feeding time, I think. Oh, sorry. <laughs> At the yard. So, they're all ready for some dinner. Hello. <laughs> Hello. You want your camera close up? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hi. Oh, good friend. <laughs> Is there one in here? Yeah, I think so. Oh, yeah. So do people Hello. own these ones? Oh, these are all Peters. Oh. I'll take you, I'll take you now. Oh, I'll show you the babies. Oh, there's babies. Like, I, I hope you guys are proud. Like, this is quite a decent day for us to have vlogged. Because yeah. Chloe's brave. So, Hi, these two 
are the babies to this one. And I was so confused, I was walking in expecting to see little horses, and these are giant. <laughs> I was like, they're not babies because they're the same size as their mum who's there. But this one's a lighter one, is Chloe's favourite. This then, one? Yeah, that one. And then there's some more free ones over there. Normally, they don't get like, they're not, they don't have much human interaction when they're first born. So this is why they get a bit like, like ju jumpy. Mm -hmm. okay. They're so scared. I'm obviously still far away. Oh. So these are the one that was in there today. Uh -huh. That's gone to a competition. Okay. With Rob, uh, Peter's son. Hello. I've never struggled with these ones, so I don't know why. Oh. Friendly. <laughs> no. You're so brave. No. I never used to be, honestly. I, was, I wouldn't even stand near one. I'm so just like, I'm just casually stood like a foot and a bit away. <laughs> oh, look at the white one. Oh, this is the one Nan likes. When I brought Nana to yeah. the yard. I won't stroke though, because she's eating, so we can get a bit. bit oh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> all right, we'll leave it to it. Privacy and all. <laughs> oh, and I'm home. Ignore my really messy background. <laughs> oh, so it is half past six, and that is my Sunday. I thought I was going to have my little brother, but he doesn't want to sleep. Well, tight. So I have a night to myself. I need to put laundry away put laundry in the wash, change my bed in, and chill. So I'm back with, you know, in good time to do all of that. Um, but yeah, it's been a nice weekend. Um, obviously it's the first day of my weekend because I was working yesterday, but other than that, you know, today's been nice. The first like start to my weekend, and then tomorrow I am um, gonna take my mum and Anna to Asda, and then I'm going to the gym. So you know, another relaxing day off. Does anyone else do this? Like as soon as they get home, they like get into the comfies or like put the dressing gown on or anything like that. Um. My dad brought me like I've got your things in the fridge. Ah, this is like my favourite. It's like my little treat. Um, even though it's not even that bad, but yeah, I absolutely love it. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I mean, my day was a little bit surprising. I wasn't expecting to go see horses, but um, yeah, it was an experience. I didn't think I would be so scared, but clearly I am. But I guess it's just something I'm not used to, so pretty much makes sense to why I'm scared, but yeah. So, well, yeah, I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Let me know if any of you are scared of horses. Like, I'm not scared, but I'm just like, I don't want to touch them. I'll just look at them from afar. <laughs> like, I don't want to ride them or anything. Um, if you want to do that Dior foundation video, any other videos follow me on instagram and i'll see you all on wednesday bye